SHA. The city of Fresno giving a first look today inside the new $20 million animal center. Our Madaris Bab joining us now from Airways and Dakota and Madaris. The center is set to officially open a little bit later this week. That's right, Stephanie, and I do want to share a little bit of a fun fact with you. Back in 1997, the city sold this property of land in 200 acres to the Gap for $2. Then in 2020, the Gap sold back five acres of land where the shelter is now for only a dollar to the city. Now you can see the $20 million facility behind me, and officials say this is long overdue. Even in triple digits, Fresno City officials all smiles as they cut the ribbon for the city's new animal center. What a great day uh, this is, and it's been long, long overdue. You really can't tell a lot about a city by the way it treats its animals. Historically, the city of Fresno has not prioritized the treatment of its pets and animals. <laughs> Up until now, because Fresno didn't have its own shelter, the city paid $6 million annually to SPCA to use their building and for animal control services. With pushback from the community, especially over euthanization rates, the city cut ties with SPCA and instead decided to partner with the Fresno Humane Animal Services. Fresno Humane, which is the same organization that runs the Fresno County shelter, will now run the new animal center. Our goal at this this uh, state-of-the-art um, center is to reduce the homeless pet population through adoption and also by connecting families with resources. Fresno Mayor Jerry Dyer says the Animal Center will provide free microchipping services in mobile vaccination neighborhood clinics. And while this facility can hold thousands of animals each year, the goal is to have these kennels empty, not full, with cats and dogs finding their forever home. Fresno Humane says it will start accepting animals on July 1st once that contract between the city and SPCA ends. And that means that these doors will be open at the end of the week. Now, because of this, there's been a lot of rumors on social media about what will happen with that SPCA building. According to the organization, they plan to continue their animal efforts and they say that they'll be doing clinics, including spay and neutering, and trying to place the animals that are already in their care and also working. With rescues for the future. Reporting live from Fresno, Madaris Bab, KC24, local news that matters.